Okay, Universe, uh, big news today. Uh, it was just announced that Hulu is getting two more Marvel TV shows. That's right, we are getting more Marvel Hulu. Up there with their new animated series that are coming soon, along with uh, Runaways. We are getting deeper into the supernatural with the Marvel uh, Universe. Finally, we've been doing so much cosmic stuff, the only supernatural stuff we've been doing was Doctor Strange. And a few other things in, in Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., which this kind of correlates to. So it's nice to actually get back to the supernatural stuff. So, yes, uh, we are finally, after what, how long since he showed up in Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D.? We are finally getting Ghost Rider. Uh, Ghost Rider is finally getting a TV show, and it will be Gabriel Luna as Robbie Reyes, Ghost Rider. Now, most of you guys know that I like Robbie Reyes, but I'm more of like a Johnny Blaze and, D and Dan Ketch fan. So when I heard the news, I was like, oh yeah, I'm gonna get, you know, we're finally gonna get like Dan Ketch or Johnny. And I'm like, no. But now don't mis now don't uh, get me wrong. Do not un uh, under, uh, you know, do not uh, misinterpret me. I like Robbie Reyes. That's f I really do dig him, and I dug him in Agents of Shield. In fact, when he showed up, he was one of the reasons why I went back to watching Agents of Shield. But when he left, I was like, "I'm done." You know, see you when you get your spin-off eventually, Robbie. So I'm fine with it. And plus, remember, in the show, it was revealed that in this continuity of Robbie Reyes's origin, because his is different. Remember, he gets his power from his uncle, uh, not not Zarathos, the spirit of vengeance. But in here, in the in the in this continuity of Agents of Shield, he got his power transferred from him from apparently, I think that was Johnny Blaze. I'm pretty sure that was the Johnny Blaze Ghost Rider. So Johnny is in the Marvel universe, and it's going to be cool to see him in here. It's going to be really cool to see um, Johnny Blaze in this show. That's going to be interesting. Maybe we'll also get Dan Ketch. Uh, Dan Ketch would be another cool one to see. And I think it would be, there was also a female Ghost Rider for a short time. Uh, Alec, uh, Alex, Alex, it's something Alexandra. I can't remember her name. She was kind of forgettable. Um, but no, this is pretty cool. Um, you know, having all those characters in there. Um, and, you know, Gabriel Luna, once again, I really dug him as Robbie Reyes. Um, so it's going to be cool to see him in this show. You know, it's going to be really cool. Maybe they'll let him be, you know, go just full dark. You know, let the show be a little darker. Not, you know, not really a four kids show. Hopefully, they can keep that up. Really hope they can keep that up and really play with that because Robbie is a pretty uh, fun character to use, and it's going to be fun to see the other Ghost Riders should they show up. Um, maybe this could all Ghost Rider could also be our way of introducing like Marvel's equivalent to Mephisto and Blackheart and all the other villains we've had in uh, the Ghost Rider comics. You know, we've been waiting to see those guys for a while, so maybe this is how we get Mephisto in the MCU, or, like I said, Blackheart, so that'd be cool. And speaking of Hell, let's talk about the other character, because it wasn't just Ghost Rider that got a TV show. Um, another supernatural character has uh, made his appearance, is finally going to make his debut in the, M in the MCU. But, um, well, MCU TV-wise. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is Damien Hellstorm. That's right, D the son of Satan himself is making his uh, Marvel debut. Now, I'm going to be real with you. I kind of expected at some point or another we were going to get a Ghost Rider TV show, whether it be about Robbie Reyes or, <clears throat> excuse me, or we were going to get like a spinoff with, with Johnny or Danny. But I never thought that Damien Hellstorm, the son of Satan, was going to get a TV show. I just thought that there was just going to be no way that we could get a son of Satan TV show. Because, yeah, it's the son of Satan. There was no way the mouse was going to allow that. You know, was going to allow that to get a TV show. But, uh, well, I'll be, uh, you know, well, I'll be fucked, right? <laughs> I'll be fucked. Um, so I think that's pretty cool. You know, I think this is pretty cool. Uh, Hellstorm, for those who don't know, is his name implies the son of Satan who was meant to bring about the apocalypse, uh, along with his sister, uh, Satana, who is, uh, I guess you could say half-sister, but it's changed a little on the TV show, apparently, and I'll get into that in a moment. But yeah, um, Damien has, is kind of like, uh, recently, they've kind of made Damien Hellstorm, in the Marvel comics at least, they've kind of made him Marvel's Constantine. 
They pretty much made him Marvel's Constantine, but not like a chain-smoking asshole, but more like he's refined. He's more like if, if Constantine was sober. That's what I'm trying to say. He's more like if Constantine was, um, was sober. That's what I'm trying to get at. Um, so, yeah. And Satana is pretty much, um, like his half-sister, but in other, con like in some, in some comics they say it's his full sister, even though they had different moms. It's, it's a weird thing. But yeah, she's kind of been built up now as like Marvel's Satana, uh, you know, Zatanna. But yeah, um... The last time I saw them in any Marvel comics was in Spirit of Vengeance, you know, Spirits of Vengeance, along with Blade and Johnny Blaze. So, anyway. So this is really cool, but let me talk about the changes they've done for Hellstorm. For one, uh, Hellstorm has taken out one of the L's. I guess the mouse said no to, the, to L, you know, to double hockey stick. Um, but the, the other major thing we look, you know, we're going to have to look at here is that um, in this continuity, um, Damien and his sister Anna are trying to discover the mysteries of their serial killer father. Okay. I, so I guess they ain't the sons of, you know, the children of Satan in here. So, alright. Um, huh. So I get, like, they said this was going to be more of, like, based on Supernatural, which I'm fine with, and it was going to be more of a horror show. So I'm fine with it. And maybe they'll just reveal, like, later on, oh, he really, you know, maybe that isn't really their father, the real father's the devil, or something like that. And again, maybe build into Mephisto. Uh, I know Mephisto isn't their father. I'm well aware Mephisto isn't their real, uh, isn't their dad. But again, they could change it in the, M in the uh, MCU. And these shows, I know I keep saying in the MCU, but these shows, according to Disney from here on out, especially the Fox shows, will have an impact on the MCU. So let's see how true it is with uh, Ghost Rider and Hellstorm. Anywho, now the other thing I want to bring up is that a lot of, they do a lot of cinematic universe, you know, they do their own like shared little universes in their universe. So could Hellstorm and Ghost Rider, you know, be the the opening door to other characters? Could we be getting a spirit of a Spirits of Vengeance show? Could a Spirit of Ven Spirits of Vengeance show be a um, a possibility? Could we be getting a Blade Hulu series, or you know, um, there are other characters, you know, or Midnight Suns? It could be Spirits of. I'm leaning towards more Spirits of Vengeance, but instead of Johnny Blaze, it's. Um, it's Robbie Reyes taking that place, and, you know, we have Blade in there, and the four, you know, those four characters, Damien, or Satana, or Anna, as she's being called, uh, all show up in there. Um, it could also be Midnight Suns, you know, but, uh, who knows, but you'd kind of need a few more characters for, uh, for, uh, Midnight Suns, and, uh, one of them's off in Sony right now, <clears throat> and, uh, who knows, maybe we could get also... Man Thing, but then again, I don't think Marvel's gonna do that, you know, with the Swamp Thing TV show, or should I say, miniseries, because I don't know what the hell's going on there. So, maybe this will be their way of being, hey, you wanted a full TV show? Uh, since Swamp Thing only had ten episodes? Well, here's Man Thing! Or, how about Werewolf by Night? You know, yeah, yeah Werewolf, I want Jack Russell! Damn it, I want Jack Russell in the, you know, in the part of the MCU. Um... Or, hell, what about, you know, you could do Tomb of Dracula. There's so many uh, options for, you know, people keep saying, oh, eventually they're going to run out of things to do in the MCU. You know, they're going to run out of characters. They haven't even scratched the surface on the supernatural elements. They're looking at, like, the cosmic stuff or stuff like that. Doctor Strange is the only real, like, supernatural thing we've had in the MCU for a while. Well, I know there's, uh, there's you know, the Runaways who do have... Uh, you know, magic and what have you, but that's not the main focus. So, yeah, why not have a, you know, some more supernatural stuff? That's untouched territory in, um, in the MCU, you know, in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. So, yeah, I'd love to see, you know, Werewolf by Night and Blade and, um, maybe get another Ghost Rider TV show with Johnny Blaze or, and or Danny Ketch. Or, what about, um, you know, Hannibal King, the vampire detective, or, you know, there's just so many routes to go, people. There's just so many, like, characters, like, they could do their own Dracula. 
there's just so many routes. There's so many routes you can go with this. So anyway, uh, you guys tell me in the comments below. Uh, tell us here at Comic Universe, what do you guys think of Ghost Rider and Hellstorm getting their own shows on Hulu? Uh, just comment below, let us know. Are you guys excited? Are you guys not? Or And are there any other Marvel Supernatural characters you want to see appear or get their own Marvel Hulu show? Uh, and once again, if you're new here, remember to click that bell for notifications, subscribe and all that. I'm DPZ, and we will see you right here once more in the universe.